Listing Diario Editorial for December 5th of 2023. University Night Schedules. Dominican universities have made great progress in the effort to incorporate the latest technologies into their teaching schemes. In fact, most already offer a hybrid model of virtual and in-person classes at different times. Their classrooms are also undergoing transformations with equipment that facilitates teaching and learning, whether in person or virtual. They are now called smart classrooms. They reflect the innovations that have already been applied by prestigious universities around the world. With this technological scaffolding, it is now possible to undertake a gradual change in their traditional nighttime schedules so that instead of in person, classes are taught on virtual platforms. Among many reasons for this important one, there are many risks for students who have to walk on foot after 10 at night from their universities to metro stations or public transportation routes at that time and even later walking through poorly lit streets with little surveillance by the police is exposing yourself to the dangers of robberies perpetrated by motorists and screens who go out at night to commit misdeeds. Previously, there were patrol units specifically destined for the so-called university corridors to monitor and protect the environments of these campuses. Even so, the risk transcend the polygons of these universities, and we do not have so many police officers to ensure the integrity and life of all the students in night sessions. I hope that universities will consider the possibility of eliminating, if possible, their in-person night classes. Given these undeniable, rela undeniable realities as risk that face without exception students who do not have motor vehicles. And not just them, but anyone who walks our streets at night. For Listing Diario, voiceover and translations by Indira Rodriguez.